hey guys you're welcome back to Ezinest kitchen you're very welcome so guys on today's episode we're going to be making tilapia fish and plantain pepper soup yeah so over here i have my chicken seasoning powder my curry powder my cayenne pepper you can use scotch bonnet pepper okay oregano my three garlic cloves ginger and enol cube my onions, salt, beef seasoning powder. Next, my pepper soup spices, ripe plantains. So feel free to use unripe plantain for this recipe. Personally, I prefer using ripe plantains. Okay, so it depends on what you want. This is what I do use, okay? And I'll be needing my basil leaf for this recipe. You can make use of your scent leaf or ugu, okay? And of course, I'll be needing my three tilapia fish. Yeah, I'll go ahead and cut them right now. Then I'll come back to you later. Yeah, stay tuned. So I'm gonna head to wash the fish, okay? So let's start cooking. So to that, I'm going to add my garlic and ginger my onions, my beef seasoning powder, oregano. You can use your thyme if you don't have oregano, okay? They taste almost the same, yeah? Curry, seasoning cube, My salt, that's okay. So next I'm going to introduce my water. This much. So I'll be cooking this for at least 10 to 12 minutes. Yeah. Hey guys. So it's been cooking for 11 minutes now. So next I'll be introducing our plantain, okay? So I'm going to cover that up to cook for an extra 10 minutes before adding other ingredients, yeah? So after 10 minutes of cooking, I added my pepper soup spices, okay? I'll be covering it again to continue cooking for at least five minutes more. So it's been cooking for five minutes now. Next, I'm going to add my chopped pepper. Okay, so you can add this earlier when you added your pepper soup spices, but I love adding mine when I'm almost done cooking. Yes, I love having that red popping color, you know? So next, I'm going to cover that up to cook more for two minutes. This is two minutes of cooking and we are done, okay? I'm going to be adding this basil leaf to complete the cooking. So at this point, if you have your fresh nchao, just add it now, that's fresh um, sand leaf, okay? So guys, we are done cooking, we are done. So you can have this recipe with your agiti, your white rice, and of course, you can enjoy it just the way it is, yeah? And guys, if you are new to my channel, a warm welcome to you. I truly appreciate you. Thank you so much for clicking on that red subscribe button. And also thanks to my old subscribers. I cherish you guys a whole lot. Thank you. Until I come your way next time, remain blessed. I love you. Bye-bye.